हेलो एंड वेलकम दिस इज जीत दोलकिया एंड यू आर वाचिंग इफ टुमारो न्यूज एटलीस्ट थ्री टोर्नेडोज टच डाउन इन वेस्टर्न मेन सैटरडे डैमेजिंग होम्स एंड बोर्ड्स एंड डाउनिंग ट्रीज इन अ रेयर सीवियर वेदर डे इन अ पाइन ट्री स्टेट्स द फर्स्ट टोर्नेडो शोन इन द फर्स्ट वीडियो अबाउ वॉज साइटेड ओवर सेबागो लेक अबाउट ट्वेंटी फाइव माइल्स नॉर्थ वेस्ट ऑफ डाउनटाउन पोर्टलैंड अराउंड टू थर्टी पी एम ईस्टर्न डेट लाइट टाइम Just over two hours later, a separate supercell thunderstorm appeared to have spawned another tornado, damaging homes and downing trees in the Moose Pond area west of Brighton, Maine. If that wasn't enough, less than two hours later, another tornado formed over the southeast portion of Highland Lake. The tornado moved onshore, snapping and uprooting several large trees, some of which fell onto building and vehicles. There was a report of one minor injury due to a person being cut by glass. A storm also caused flash flooding that made some roads impassable in Brighton, Oxford, Denmark, Sweden, Waterford and Ottisfield. The tornado briefly lifted before setting back down on the west shore of Long Lake, just northeast of Brighton, where a campground was particularly hard hit. This area received extensive damage resulting from numerous trees falling onto vehicles and buildings. That's all for now. For more news updates, stay tuned with us. It's tomorrow news. Jeet Dolakia.